Uh, okay. I'm bored. I had an idea. We're taking this RGB strip, whatever you want to call it, putting it in here. This is from an aquarium. The RGB strip is from an aquarium. And yes, there's contacts. Yes, I'm putting it in something metal. I will be taping over the contacts to make sure that it's safe ish. That's that ish. But for some reason, this board does not like the stuff sticking to it. Which could be the um, silicone base that they use to waterproof it. But, uh, there's that. And no, I'm not going to like try and make the tape perfect and all that. Because it is in a medicine cabinet. More or less designed to be a nightlight is why I'm doing this. No real reason other than that. Plus I'm bored. Okay. So now that most of the contacts that felt like they were exposed because these right here seem like they're under the silicone, so this should be all right. And now, I'm still not sure if I wanna put it in the back, like so, or where the button's on this side, or in the front, like so. So, <clears throat> yep. Let me figure that out and we'll be right back. Oh. Alright, I've chosen it's going to go in the back uh, because it will be, I think it's going to be easier with the button over here than up here in the front. Plus then, I, then it should be easier wire management. Although I may still put it in the front. I don't know yet. I will figure that out once I start looking at it more in depth. Medicine cabinet has to come off the wall and stuff so I can actually see what I'm doing up here. But yeah, we'll be back after that. Alright, medicine cabinet is down. There's a drip screw. There it is. This is going to be a multi step video. Because right now all I'm doing is like getting the light in and all that. I'm planning on getting the like nice gloss paint or something and psh, repaint it. But yep, when I come back, the little holes will be drilled and yeah. The update had to switch it. The metal was too hard to cut with. What I have was. And a wood drill bit. I do a lot with this Leatherman, including building the shelves that are going to be next to this, which are already up. Plus the one our uh, router sitting on. So, as you can tell, got the holes. Haven't checked to see if the light fits. Oh, wait, yeah. I got. <clears throat> I also have to do something in here with these, which I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. Yes, the inside ain't the prettiest, but it works, and it's easier to work with than metal. And if I real, if we're really not worried about it, we can paint it, sand it, paint it, whatever. But yeah, let me get these little things cut in so I could get the light bar in and we'll go from there. 
Okay, so I got the cutouts in. I got those side cutouts in. Yes, it's on. Obviously, I had to test it beforehand. Multicolor. Well, maybe not addressable RGB, but it's at least somewhat RGB. There you go. Now it changes in between tones. Okay, and then off, and then you got one color. Next part will be once it's mounted on the wall. I am using some bread ties to hold this in, so where what's going on there doesn't have to occur. So yeah. Okay, light bar is mounted. Plugs more or less set up. Screws are prepped because I'm going into a plastic setting then instead of metal, so I have to have a washer, which they're all set up. And I'll cut back in once it's mounted and it's ready to be shown off. And those are the shells I'm talking about I did with the level. Okay, yeah, it's more or less done. All I have to do is put everything back on it. It's pretty level, the door doesn't want to move on its own, so I think I did pretty good. Other than that, most everything that's exposed is somewhat safe to touch. So, yeah. Well, not somewhat, it is, because I would already got shocked by doing that. So, yeah. Peace, if you like our con- it, well. If you dislike our content, you know where that button is. But if you like our content, content, please leave a like. Subscribe if you like. Um, hit us up on Facebook, YouTube. Well, this is on YouTube, but YouTube, Twitter, uh, Twitch, and yeah, peace. Okay, okay. Wrap up the video. Oh, well, actually. Slightly, see me. Works well. Light up the bathroom halfway decently. I don't know which one I like more, but the that one, the slow breeze. But yeah, should work good as a night light. I'll test it tomorrow morning up. But anyway, yep. Peace. This is an additive to the other part.